this one, it smells good, but it kind of smells like those, um, those colognes that they sell at like Walgreens that are knockoffs of like real cologne. This one smells like one of those Barbie styling heads from when we were children. Five minutes? That's not real. <laughs> not enough. When I buy a mask, I don't want to buy a spatula to go along with it because I already spent money on the mask. So this is like the best of both worlds. You buy the mask and it basically comes with the applicator. You really have to invest your time into washing your face off, washing your hands off, probably your sink and your towel and everything. So having a stick and kind of eliminating that messy aspect would be awesome. Opening this and applying it directly to my face just feels a little gross. Like bacteria is just gonna be transferred back and forth. I'm not a scientist, what do I know? This is kind of really soothing to me. It feels so nice gliding onto my skin. I feel like when you press a little harder, you get some big globs. I feel like it might be nice if there was a way that there was like different sizes to apply so I could really get in the nooks and crannies because I feel like the sides of my nose is where I see the most blackheads and that's why I like these masks. I think I used a little bit more than you're supposed to, but you know, that's all right. Maybe I'll just have very clear skin after this. Easier to get like the precise areas like around your forehead, whereas like I'm doing it with my hands, I'm kind of just like slapping it on. I feel like most face masks are like 10 to 20 minutes, like at the very least. And I feel like I want to just like lay back and relax while I'm using my face mask. It's not something that I'm like, all right, five minutes, like I've got to do a mask right now. So I'm going to turn on my timer for five minutes. Boop. So the timer is officially done, which means I can now remove my snap mask. So honestly, my face feels pretty sticky and dry, which is not exactly what you want out of a brightening, glow-boosting snap mask stick. I think this was probably one of the easier times I've had taking off a face mask. I feel like it came off super easy. I don't see any residue. Usually I'm at the sink for at least 10 minutes, and this came off with just a wet paper towel. My skin feels super soft, and I feel like nice and refreshed, so I think it did a pretty good job. My skin feels really nice and soft after using the snap mask, but with face masks, you'll never know how well they work until you use it for a long time. comparison, I have a normal face mask with me and I'm going to apply this and time myself to see how long it takes me to apply, let it dry, and then remove it compared to the snap mask stick. I got my stopwatch ready. Here we go. We're about to hit the five minute mark. Now, Woo! And the mask is still wet. This face mask is finally pretty dry. It still feels a little bit wet. And it has been 20, almost 21 minutes. So already the snap mask kind of takes the lead when it comes to application and drying time. It was virtually mess-free the entire time, from application to removal. I think that this would be a great mask for on the go or traveling. You could just throw it right in your purse or in your suitcase. It won't get messy everywhere, and I don't think it's a liquid, so you can bring it on the airplane with you, no problem. Didn't have to get anything on my hand, which was great. I would be interested to try it like over like a week or a month to see kind of if I can see that difference in my skin. It's hard to say if um, this is something I would use. I think the idea of the stick is something I'd be really interested in. I'm just not sure this formula is for me.